Welcome back to another, let me just shut that, Trucker Tim vlog. The Cougar is here. I've got some to show you under the bonnet. The air horns. They're all plumbed in, ready to go. We're going to give plenty of tones in a minute. Let's just put the bonnet down. The stickers are holding up quite well on the Cougar. Just pull that bit off. So we're just about to head over to Transtech, have a look at the Magnum, do a few bits to it because it's Newark Truck Fest this weekend. I'm taking the Magnum. Also in this vlog, we are taking my Santorini Blue E92 M3 4 litre V8 to an airfield, guys. We're gonna take this down the runway. I can't wait for that. Shut that back up, let's hop in. And whilst we're at the airfield, I've got some big exciting news about what we're gonna be doing there potentially fingers crossed but more about that later in the vlog i've got some air fresheners here for the guys at transtech as well one for the magnum if you'd like an air freshener or a sticker or any kind of trucker tin merch link is in the description for the merch store i'm just waiting for a call back from somebody we could in this vlog be driving a scania t-cab that'd be a dream come true potentially i'll let you know later in the video once i've had confirmation if that's going to happen or not let's put the compressor on get some air in the system yes build that air up for tones okay then are you ready the first time of giving tones in the cougar unless you're a trucker tim member of course because the first trucker tim members video i did i've done some tones on there for the members only if you want to join the trucker tim members only you can i'm putting up videos nearly every single day just for you members my scania's in there my four series is in there Anyway, where were we? Let's give a couple of tones. Are you ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> tones in the Cougar. Let's put the windows down here a bit better. Ready? <laughs> We've used a bit of air there. The old compressor's kicked in. Chuck her down here, boy. Couple of tones. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's an illegal maneuver. Oi, you. Excuse the compressor. Let's give some tones to that dryer. <laughs> <laughs> Lead distribution. <laughs> oh, compressor's back on. We have arrived. I suppose we better announce our arrival. <laughs> what is it they say? If you don't look back at your own car when you walk away, you've got the wrong car. <laughs> you got some healthy cobwebs on here. Here she is. The Magnum has got a light bar on the top now with a couple of laser lights. They're going to go on here. Look at that. So I can give tones when I turn up at Nook. What we're going to do now, we've got these disco lights up here and these are going to shine onto the back on the subs to make for a nice effect in the evening because they go with the music. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, look. So we didn't like the brightness of these much. So we got this bad boy. We're gonna put that in there. Just about fits in there. That's a lot brighter. We've just tried it, it's a lot brighter than that. We could put these somewhere else, couldn't we? In the fog lights. Look. Hello mate, you're not bad, you? Yeah, no worries. Yeah, thank you very much. I'll see you Thursday. Cheers mate, bye 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 bye. Yes, we're gonna take a tea cab out. I'm going to drive it as well. Thursday. That's going to be in this video. It's only Tuesday today, but I'm doing that on Thursday. It's literally a dream come true, this is. Anyway, into the woodwork station. We've got the light here. We need to mount it on a piece of wood and then put it in the storage locker. Is it Thursday yet? Right, where's Ant gone? I like it. Is this a dangerous lunch? Yeah, it stops you from... Right, let's start wiring up then. Look at the size of that. Wires oh, everywhere in here. Ah! Sat on a screw. It's like those um, licorice laces. I can't get it in. It's not going to go, is it? Of course it will. Sorry. Sorry, mate. Sorry. We've got to put an inverter in here and then we'll plug that into the inverter. You're in there then like a yo-yo. There's a lot going on in here. It's a bit busy, isn't it? It is a bit. Just take a minute to appreciate my uh, system I've got going on here. Oh, that'll do. It won't fit. It will, we'll make it fit. This is what we're going to run the disco light off. Look at the size of this. Is it going to fit in that Jesus! They use them in like canal boats and stuff like that. 
an inverter for a boat, speakers for a boat. We might as well have a boat. There we go. Get it. What an achievement. God, it's miserable. Alright. Yeah. Inverter is installed. Disco light is installed. Here's the plug. Just got to plug that into there. Wire them into there. There's a Chinook and. Oh, wow. <laughs> Is it air freshener time yet? Yeah, yeah, let's get it. Most important piece to the puzzle. What's that smell? It's my air freshener, I've got it out of the bag. Oh my God. Do you not like it? Yeah, it's nice. Look, there's Mark Pocklington just leaving. Where can I put it? Do you want me to answer that? <laughs> yes, politely. I'll put it on your plug. Okay. And this is the official installation. We're gonna screw it in so it can't be nicked at Truck Fest. I want to see if this flaps. I'm sure it will flap. My ears flap, so that will. <laughs> oh, it didn't even the move. Windscreen was like that, <laughs> the windscreen was like this. The windscreen was like this. The truck and tin sticker just did that. <laughs> They're air fresheners, Tim, by the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. word. Open heart surgery now. Open heart surgery. Yes, mate. Look at that. That's so much better than the others. Let's go around the front. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, it had to be them. Them other ones just didn't do it, did they? They can't wait to take this to Newark. Look at the backboard, look. Get them in there. We've got to polish them up tonight with this metal polish. Give them some tones. I'm home. Let's go and show Mrs. Trucker Tim what she's going to be doing this evening. <laughs> Hello. Yeah? I've got something for you to do this evening. This is metal polish. Right, what this do you expect me to do with that? Polish these. I'm right. Oh. Sorry. They've come out really, really, really good. Look at that. Very impressed with those. They are ready for the Magnum. That's it for today. I'll speak to you in the morning when we're getting the M3 out the garage and going to the airfield. Speak to you in the morning. Day two of the vlog. We're now about to get the car out the garage. Just unplug her, take her to the airfield. I'm so excited for today. We're gonna have some fun today in this. Oh, what's that on the roof? No idea. All right, stick that in there. Ooh, we got a full tank of petrol. We'll leave that there, warming up for a second. Trucker Tim, tell us where you've been. Let's go and give it a hoon down the runway. We've just got to get some heat into the engine, guys, before we can give it any beans. Woo! A little bit of a downshift here. Oh, yeah. And it's nice and cool this morning as well. <clears throat> it's not very warm, so these cars love the cold air. So good, such a good car. Can't wait to get it on the airfield. <laughs> Let's get there, come on. Jesus Christ alive, Timbo. Woo -hoo -hoo. She just goes, just goes. This lorry is being towed by a wrecker. Can you see that? <laughs> wow, this thing is quick. Listen to a purr. We're nearly there now. There's some lovely driving roads around here. I can tell you that. Some nice little enclosed bits as well, so you can get a bit more noise. <laughs> this is nice through here. <laughs> I love this car. Absolutely love this car. Jesus. 
Sturgate Airport. Here we are. I've got my cameraman. Here's Luke. Hello, YouTube. Here, here you go. Thank you very We're much. We're going to go down the uh, down the runway, apparently. I don't really feel like I should be doing this, Luke. So um, you are on. allowed to do it. We are unlicensed. You've got your show your radio. I've got then. the radio. <laughs> To make sure we're not going to upset any, Hang on, any I'm aviators. Put my key in ignition. I'm all of a fluster. Okay, oh. so that's all right. That's all right. Go past this one here. <laughs> so look, we are generally on an airfield. Well, there are look at the here. So watch, uh, watch this one here. Watch the tail. Watch the tail. They're not due to start up just yet, so we're okay. 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 Go around this gap. Oh, don't wing there. There is the wing. There is genuine people in There's these aircraft. People in the aircraft. There's a hangar. <laughs> there you go. Oh, look at that hangar. Yeah. I can see my we're truck. Having, we're, we're taxiing we're, out. We are taxiing out on onto the airfield. <laughs> This is like a dream come true for me to do this. I've always wanted to go on an airfield. It's uh, it's not car. something you can do it's every not, day. No. So I'm just going to make a radio call. Okay. Uh, Snowgate traffic all stations. Just to let you know there will be a car running up and down the runway. Snowgate traffic. I'll call you Monaco one and uh, North North traffic at the moment. Oh. Jesus, Luke. There's no big bumps, is there? No, there shouldn't be. <laughs> Wow! It's very fast. <laughs> How many horsepower is it? Uh, 420. Okay. I'm going to have to try a little slide though. Yeah, you, can, right? you can try sliding. In this uh, in this bit here is quite a nice area for yeah, it okay. because there's no I've runway I've never lines. done this before so you have to bear with me. Okay. I don't know how this will go. Neither do I. <laughs> that is a slide. That is a definite slide. <laughs> Quite possibly a march. You could put some more on if you wanted. I might do a couple more marks. <laughs> <laughs> and there's actual smoke there as well. Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> that is so much fun. God, it revs, doesn't it? Look how hard it revs. A really open space, it does really feel fast. It does feel very fast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having the time of my life. Keep looking up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, still plenty of tread on there. So, this guy here has just asked for some airfield information before he goes flying. <laughs> is there any BMW M3 yeah, sliding about? Is, <laughs> is there anybody that's going to cause us a problem? Me. And then the guy in the office has just sort of said, No, off you go, give them, give them some information, and, and that's about off it. Off they go. I feel like a pilot in my car waiting for clearance. Yeah. Which is basically what, what we did. Jesus. This is a very different kind of point of view, isn't it? This is. I usually do trucking point of view. This is a this is a <laughs> This is very different. Oh, there's, there's some air horns in the boot, by the way. Oh, right, okay. That's what's hanging around. Luke did say he'd take me up in this today, but I'm not keen. <laughs> I'm not very keen. Sounds like there's some gaps around here. I can hear uh, wind. There, there, there might be the odd few, yeah. You reckon I'll come up again another day, you'll take me up? Oh, I think that would be fantastic, yeah, if, you, <laughs> if you're brave enough. Uh, I want to, I want to. <laughs> Go with my fear. 
So if you're brave enough, absolutely. Look at all this. Look at this storage area. Yeah, it's uh, pretty much good for your ham sandwiches and that's about <laughs> it, really. And your first aid box. And your first aid box. In case you need that up in the air. Yes. <laughs> and there your rudder pedals. And then I it's, think I'll be good at flying. And then it's learning to do it all as in, in, yeah, all in like, one like action. Yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> learning to do it all in one action. So action. Yeah. Next time. Now then, the reason I'm at this airfield today is basically because of this space here. So you see all this space from the red sign there all the way along here, right down to that grass there. In the very near future, you are going to be able to come here. I'm going to get a truck and a trailer. You're going to be able to come here and have a go at driving an Arctic, hooking up the trailer, dropping the trailer. We can have a few obstacles and places where you can park. Um, we're just about to do all sorts. Basically, you'll have an hour with me or two hours or whatever. Free reign on this area with an Arctic. You meet me, just basically, we just do what we like on this area with an Arctic. It's going to be absolutely awesome. So make sure you stay tuned on all my socials for when I announce that this is happening, that this live. And as well, when my Scania 4 series is done, I'll probably have it here some days as well. Probably park it in one of the sheds here and you can come down and drive that as well. Passenger ride with me, drive it, we'll get the pipes on and basically thrash it up and down this massive bit of tarmac here. It's going to be awesome, I can't wait. Trucker Tim experience days coming soon guys. And as well where you see us driving the M3 up and down there, we can use that as well for truck shows. I'm going to have a Trucker Tim Tangs and Tones truck show or something here. We have truck shows and while the truck show is on, you'll be able to drive trucks on here as well with me. Um, and yeah, just, it's just going to be awesome. Any age. So yeah, basically, Trucker Tim has full use of this airfield. Yes! Make sure you spread the word that you're going to be able to come and do Trucker Tim Experience Days with all your friends and family. It's going to be epic. But for now, we better get back in the M3 and blast over to Transtech and drop off the air horns for the Magnum. The next time we come here may well be with a truck to keep here for you guys to drive. I'm excited for the future. We'll have a Trucker Tim sign on here as well. Now, we have to drive sensibly. Not like we did up and down that airstrip. No smoke, no poke. <laughs> we didn't just race then. We did. We definitely didn't just race. See you later, mate. <laughs> that was awesome. Here we go. We're at Transtech. Where are the horns? I know they've been given a bit of a hard time in the back here this afternoon. Here they are. Horns. Tones on the M3. What do you think? Yes or no? I think yes. God, we've given these tyres a hard ride today. But I've had fun, so that's all that matters. Right, let's get these to Ant. I think Ant's gone home, actually. Put them there for now. So the next time we see this, the tone should be on. So I'm coming away from Transtech with this bit of plastic. I've no idea why. Right, I'm going to put it in the boot. Richie said you can have that if you like. I was like oh, okay, I'll take it. No idea. This, I think. Oh. oh, that feels good. Just that sort of thing you've always wanted to do, isn't it? You never really get time, time. You can't really do it, can you? Not that I get in trouble anyway. Oh, oops. That'll polish out. Oh, this Woo! Nice. Oh. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Ready to race? Not quite. Not quite. That's good. Oh. I like this. I do like this. We don't need that. Right, next. Is this how we remove bumpers? Oh, 
Oh dear. This is ideal at the end of a stressful day at work. Just come here and smash a car up. Oh! oh! I'm making hard work of this, I think. Yeah. Right, should we? Oh, there we go. Right, if we. It's off! Right. Oh, don't do that side. Mate. <laughs> That's off. <laughs> I feel like a vandal. Oh, I love it. That'd be easy. <laughs> oh, just like that. <laughs> and just to clarify, lads, this car has actually got an MOT and is away for the road. Yeah. Yeah. That seems wrong. Absolutely fine, really. I've just. I've just destroyed it. I've always wanted to kick a wing mirror off. But... Ooh. Ooh. Oh, there it goes. That's off. So what happens when you throw a lump hammer at a car windscreen? Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'll buy a new bonnet. I didn't. You sit here and gone over top of the car and landed down here. Oh dear. I'll just fix that with a little plaster. There we go. Don't get a job at auto glass, will you? Oh. That's and that's out. it. That's a window screen out. Just chuck down there like a slab. So, Kings Lynn, guys, on the 15th of October. Look out for this bad boy. Okay, so it's the following day. I really enjoyed that yesterday, just smashing up that car. I can't believe the car as well, guys, was had a full MOT, fully road legal, nothing wrong with it, really. But yeah, it's been smashed up to go banger racing. I really enjoyed that. I want to go back and do the next one they do. Anyway, I'm highly excited right now, guys, because we are driving in the Cougar to go and make one of my dreams come true. I'm going to go and drive a Scania T cab on the road on the road we are going on the road in a scania t cab we'll do some point of view because i can't wait to see what it's like to drive my dream truck and not only that guys not only that it is a t730 a 730 that's my that'll be the, the biggest engine truck i've ever driven as well on the road i've sat in one and revved one like a big engine one but never driven one i think it's got side pipes and stacks and Ah, I'm so excited. <laughs> Tons. Literally on this video, we're, we're ticking off three things off my bucket list. One, taking my M3 on a uh, airfield, doing some donuts and high speed runs. Two, smashing up a car. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> it's very rare you get the chance to do that. And three, this one, going to drive a Scania T cab. It's like three things in one video. <laughs> oh, compressor's come back on. You stole me air. Oh my god. There's no way I'm about to drive that. Are you ready? I'm about to take this out, guys. Now, if you followed me on TikTok for a while, you may remember I done a TikTok on this when it was at TransTech. And now I'm about to drive it. I can't believe this is about to happen. Look, it's at 730. Look at the stacks. It's got four. That's mental! And the outdoor speakers here, twin tag, like the 4 Series. Look at it. Oh my word. So just giving it a quick swill off here. This is going to be at Newark this weekend. Well, let's hope it's going to be there. Depends how I get on driving it. Let's have a little look inside. Wow. I mean, I just, I just cannot get over the fact that this is happening. I know I keep on about it, but I feel so privileged. <laughs> Wooden floor. This is a table here. Granite, actual granite. It's got intercooler up there. All the lockers. The beds up there. Look at these seats. This literally should have been a video on its own, shouldn't it really? There's a subwoofer there. I'd actually forgotten how nice this truck is. Look at these door cars and the speakers. We put the side lights on. Look at that. This all lights up. <laughs> Here we go. I'm very nervous. <laughs> I 
I've forgotten how to drive. Right. Look at this wheel. It's the first time I've driven a truck with one of these wheels as well. We're moving. It's so nerve wracking. What was that noise? <laughs> <laughs> Are they broken? Oh. oh, look at this, you see the bonnet? I've indicated out of there, what about that? Very professional. Oh my god, look at this nose. You're a proper king of the road, don't you? Here he is, look. Give me. <laughs> It looks like that nose is in the dike. <laughs> From here, it looks like I'm running in that grass, but I'm nowhere near it. Listen to the turbo. Uh oh. You see the bonnet moving, can't you? Now, I'm not my usual self in this, guys, because I'm, uh, I've got my concentrated head on. Hello. Look, look. How can you walk by? They didn't even look at it. Just walk by. Didn't, how can you not look at it? We good. This is the definition of tang. Let's go to Hunstanton. Wow. <laughs> Let's go. Just throw you out with the old whip. I'm miles away from the curb, but I feel like I'm a lot closer because of the bonnet. Away from them trees. Oh, it's double glazed. I feel like I'm on my driving lesson. <laughs> I actually feel like I'm on my driving lesson. Let's go then. Let's go along the seafront. <laughs> go. I can see the sea. <laughs> it's around this roundabout. Oh, I love it. <laughs> oh, I never thought I'd be doing this. The first time I drive a tea cab through Hunt Stanton. This is madness. It's quite tight through here. <gasps> Turn the sea. Oh, tide's out. Oh, look at this, look. Do we want some tangs? <laughs> look at that, what a lovely day. I'll pull up and do a bit of crazy golf. A little bit of point of view. Check the blind spot. Let's go. <laughs> well, I never thought we'd be doing this on the Trucker Tim channel. Well, not this early on, anyway. Ooh, stop, stop. Remember, you got a nose on there. <sighs> this is madness. I think I'm in. You have to remember. <laughs> I think I'm in. We're off. Paul's like a train. Oh, God, it's narrow through there. This is mad. I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh God, I hope we don't meet anything big around here. Let's give some tea cab tangs. Nice reflection in the windows there. So you may have wondered where the cameraman's gone. I kicked him out. Well, this will be a moment that I never ever forget. And what a day to be doing it on as well. Awesome sunny day by the coast as well. Getting a bit more confident with it now. Love the size of the steering wheel. When we get back to the yard, guys, we'll um, see if we can get the sound system working. 
I'm not going to mess around with that while we're driving. I really think Data Shredder should buy me one of these. Can't see it happening though. Oh, what's that island? Oh, oh God. Oh, this just took me by surprise. Oh, why am I shuffling the wheel? I never shuffle the wheel. <laughs> oh God. Oh, not now trucking sounds. Sometimes. <laughs> I think I made a jump. God. Oh. This house sticks out a bit here. Oh. Oh. He's got a shed on his trailer. Look at that. Thank you. <gasps> Ooh. God. In we go. Onto the holiday site. Ooh. So not only on my first time driving one of these, big bump there. <gasps> um, it's been on a lovely day to the beach along the coast. And now I'm driving it through a caravan site. Imagine sitting in your caravan, just having a look, a cup of tea or something, you know, and then this big old beast comes by your window. Cool, if I was here on holiday and this come by my caravan, I'd be like, oh my God, there's a tea cab. I'd probably even chase it. Ooh, what's the shrubs? Well, there we go. I'm sorry if I've been a little bit quiet on this one, like, like my normal self, but I've just been really, really concentrating because you really don't want to break anything on this. Let's see if we can get some music playing. This Apple CarPlay, so. That's on. What an experience. And there she is, in the shed. It's all ready for Newark Truck Fest this weekend. You can see it all lit up now properly. Yeah, make sure you keep your eyes peeled for this one at Newark. Well then, there we go. We're going back out now through the caravans. And I've just gone into reflective mode. If it wasn't for like Trucker Tim and what I'm doing and everything, there's no way I'd got to ride out in that. Like all his family follow me and every, the, all, all the workers that work here know about me. And that's like how it's got me trans tech. It was actually Scania that sorted this out for me. So shout out to Scania Truck East. What an absolute awesome experience. One I'm never ever gonna forget. And I'm so happy and pleased I've been able to share it with you guys. Awesome. So it's currently half past five. I'm just leaving Heacham. I'm gonna go home now and edit this ready for tomorrow basically 11 and a half hours time this video is going live and then tomorrow I've got a film in the Magnum going to Newark and then film the whole of Newark Truck Fest for you guys let me know in the comments if you're coming to Newark because I'll be reading the comments on Friday and I'll be looking out for you guys so yeah I'm just basically I'm gonna head home now get editing and just process what's happened this week so much has happened this week guys Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you did for any reason, you can also give it a thumbs down. Make sure you leave a comment because I read all of your comments. I give you all a little heart as well. And don't forget, if you want to become a member, please feel free to join as a Trucker Tim member. And I do special members only videos. I think I'm on the third one now. So yeah, they're there to watch if you want to. And there's a link to become a member in the description of this video. And don't forget, obviously, to hit the subscribe button, turn on a little bell for plenty more videos to come. I'll speak to you on the next one, guys. Cheers!